So we, the Midland Metro Alliance, we've been very busy the last three years building the new West Midlands Metro extensions. This has been mainly visible for the last 18 months, two years time, uh, where we've been being more visible on site. And what we would like to recognize is how proud we are of all our people that has been working either on site, very visible, behind the hoardings, but also the people that we have here in our offices. I'm really proud and I would like to thank all the team who has been working very hard, particularly uh, very qualified individuals that are helping us to build a better West Midlands Metro. In particular, there are so many opportunities that we have here in the West Midlands to make sure that we deliver together all the different West Midlands Metro extensions. So my name is Karen Wharton. Um, I work within Human Resources within the Midland Metro Alliance, uh, supporting all of the individuals that come and work on the projects. Hi, uh, my name is Jess Sambi, I'm one of the project accountants here at the MMA. Um, we look after the uh, project funding and the project budgets and making sure everything's delivered on time. I am the systems CAD designer that involves everything that goes under the tar uh, track in, stem in terms of cable ducting for the tram to operate, stop and start, <laughs> basically. And I enjoy going I'm doing because it's part of you know developing the West Midlands It's part of encouraging people to use transport it's just a challenge it's just a nice nice challenge my name is Ara Chowdhury I'm working as assistant project man manager on the centenary square extension I'm excited to be part of um, transforming the West Midlands as it's challenging and I'm learning loads every day I'm also really excited to see what we can achieve um, and what we can accomplish um, and hopefully we can transform the West Midlands for the better for everyone the important part for the Midland Metro Alliance is for us to um, build the project on time and on budget obviously um, but also in addition to that to make sure that um, we use local people for the project um, from our point of view what we want to do is build a project that local people are involved with that local suppliers deal with in addition to that we want to make sure from the project that we build we leave a legacy of um, skilled developed people in the immediate area Hi, I'm Paul Brown, the Construction Director for the MMA. I am also Project Director for Wolverhampton, CSQ and Edgebaston. Um, really looking forward to the family day and uh, welcoming in all the people and all the families. Be great uh, to see what the, the, the family members have achieved out there, um, doing a wonderful job. Um, and hopefully CSQ will be the biggie when it's opened and enter into service in December 2019. So my name's Natalie, I'm the Sustainability Manager here at the Metro Alliance and I'm really excited about this project because we're going to be transforming lives in the future when the tram's built but also we get to make a difference while we're constructing it as well. My name's Tom Bissell, I'm a stakeholder liaison officer, uh, primarily on the Wentzbitter Bradley Hill extension although I do help out on the other extensions as well. And and, um, I feel like I've got a, a personal interest in it because I'm from Netherton, so the, the Wentzbitter Broadhill extension kind of means a lot to me. I know that the area needs it and I'm quite excited for it to, to become a reality. Just leaving a bit of a legacy. I know it sounds a bit cheesy and a bit corny, but I think it's, it's something, you're leaving something behind that's going to be used for many years. I want to change uh, the transport in the West Midlands and bring a sustainable uh, transport mode into the region. There are so many skills and so much knowledge needed to build what we've been building in big cities and busy towns. And I'm so proud of the team that we have here at the Midland Metro Alliance. I really wanted to thank them all as we approach to our third anniversary.